But what I hate are boxes that don't open. But I find if you go to the other side, for some reason it will open. Except for this box. <laughs> I'm Wigo Warrior, aka Julie, and welcome back to my channel. Also, Happy New Year! It's the year 2021. Fingers crossed, this is a good year. Not starting off so great. Alright, I'm super excited. I'm going to be doing my first unboxing of the year. And that unboxing is the BoxyCharm Base Box. For anyone who doesn't know, BoxyCharm is a beauty subscription, and this is the $25 a month base box where you receive five full-size products. If you're interested in seeing what I got, then you're in the right place, and keep on watching. All right, so we do have a card. It says, Fresh Start. Oh, that couldn't be more true of what's necessary. What is up with my iterations? This happened in the last box as well. So the number is not like iteration 32. It's some lengthy number I will list on the screen or put in the information box. Um, I digress. All right, let's grab the first item. Ooh, what is this? It's heavy. This is from Pharmacy, and it is Deep Sweep. What is that? It's a 2% BHA pore cleansing toner. Oh, that explains why it's heavy because it's liquidy. I love toners. I love A -H -A BHA. Anything that exfoliates. But what I hate are boxes that don't open. But I find if you go to the other side, for some reason it will open. Except for this box. I will cut to me opening the box. Yay, box open. Ooh, protective packaging. Oh, look at that. It all just kind of... This is a very uh, heavy... It's real glass. Okay, so the Pharmacy Deep Sweep 2% BHA Pore Cleansing Toner retails for $28. Super excited. Let's see. Oh, there's a little protective bit. I don't think it has a scent. But it is made with moringa and papaya. Comment down below if you know what moringa is. Don't make me Google it. Just list down below. All right. On to the next item. What is this? I presume some kind of eye duo? Because she's winking. Um, it's by Queen or Ovine. Or let me read the uh, card so I don't keep guessing. Ooh, that rhymed. Okay. So this is from... Cuvine Studio, and it's known as the Dragon Duo. It retails for $28. Still don't know what it is. Okay. Oh, it's a duo of what I presume will be eyeliners. So one, yep, is going to be just a gel liner. And the other, does it have a, yes, I love it when they have a ball, is going to be liquid. What kind of a tip are you? Let's do a swatch. Ooh, it's very black, very liquidy. I believe it is felt tip. Let me see if the card says what kind of tip it is. It does not say. But it does say that it's semi waterproof formula. What? To me, waterproof is either black or white, yes or no. You can't sort of be waterproof. All right, it did say it was smudge-proof as well. There are the swatches. They're both very dark and black. 
which is lovely. Well, the gel liner is not quite as black as the uh, liquid liner, but let's do a little smudge test here. Okay. The liquid one is the one I'm most concerned with with smudging. The gel liners, it's to me, it's normal that they kind of smudge. That wasn't too bad, but if you do not like smudgy um, gel liners, then yeah, not for you. All right, on to the next item. What is this? Apple and Balm Glow Lip Mask. Seraphine Botanicals. Oh, I'm not familiar with that brand. Interesting packaging. Or a lip balm. It, uh, it looks like, reminds me of hand cream from L'Occitane. Okay, it comes safety sealed. Interesting. And you squirt it out and then use your finger. Let's see what the card has to say. Okay, so the Seraphine Botanicals Apple and Balm Glow Lip Mask retails for $25. She's pricey. It says, boost hydration and glow with this protective lip mask formulated with shea butter, apricot, plus jojoba and rosehip oils that will synergistically keep lips chap-free, smooth, and plumped all at once. It is made with green apple and pineapple extracts to help with rid lips of unsightly dead skin cells and fine lines. Ooh, I wonder if it smells and tastes lovely. Okay, next item. Ooh, this is the star and this is the one I selected. It's all coming back to me. This is the Pure 4-in-1 Tinted Moisturizer in the shade LG3. And it does have broad spectrum SPF 30, 20, I can't read. So the Pure 4-in-1 Tinted Moisturizer retails for $35. Yes, it's safety sealed. All right, well, I'm going to leave the safety seal on because I have, I don't even want to count how many open and ongoing different BB cream, CC creams, and foundations. But when I decide to give this a try, I will make sure I film a first impression video. All right, on to the last item. We have a palette from Violet Voss. This is the All of You Forever. Oh, I think I want to say I love you, but they made it all cheeky with saying All of You Forever. And this retails for $34. Let's see what the color story is all about. I'm going to presume since the packaging's green and the title is olive that this is going to be green. Ooh, it's very pretty though. We have a lot of warm kind of uh, browns with a hint of like terracotta and then if you're really into green this has some lovely greens. All right. Let's recap what we got in the month of January. So we got a Violet Voss palette. We got an interesting packaging from a brand I'm not familiar with, um, Lip Mask. We got a duo of uh, eyeliners. We got a lovely um, toner from Pharmacy. And a 4-in-1 Tinted Moisturizer from Pure. That is a pretty good box. 2021, you're starting off right. All right, leave your comments down below and let me know what you thought of the box. I'm going to list on the screen the complete box value. Um, I, I don't want to say I'm speechless, but I don't have anything bad to say. That was BoxyCharm. Good job. 2021, don't want to say you're off to a great start in general, but when it comes to a beauty subscription unboxings, good start. All right, thanks everyone. I really appreciate you watching. If you haven't done so yet, I would love for you to subscribe. For those who have, thank you. 
please leave me a comment and click that thumbs up button. All right, thanks everyone. Oh, and for those who are cat lovers, I got a new kitten. Isn't he cute? Mwah. All right, cheers.